Hi, Brad from WordPressSites.net. Uh, this is the second video on how to move your blog, a new blog, uh, to your own host or domain. Uh, there's several different methods you can use to use it. I normally use a uh, premium WordPress plugin which I've written about. It's under Move WordPress. So if you have a look at my site, WordPressSites.net, and you're wanting a simple solution, uh, there's a very easy solution under Move WordPress, the Move WordPress tab at the top there. But here's another way to do it, and I've just done a video on how to create a, a database, WordPress database. And uh, the next step in this is how to edit your WP config file, which is pretty straightforward. I've written a text uh, instruction on how to do it, but I'll just show you how to do it by video. The first thing to do is uh, when you've got your folder, which has got all your, your website contents in there, you need to locate the config file. So we'll have a look for that now. You'll see you've got your main three folders there. And if we come down here, we'll see config file. So we'll open up the config file, which is pretty straightforward. You'll need uh, Notepad to do that or some sort of editor, but uh, just your basic Microsoft Notepad will open up this PHP file. And here it is here. The information we need to change is the DB username, which is database username, the database name and the database password. So if you've already got something in here, you'll need to change it to the new database details, which you would have received when you created the new database in the previous step. So it's just a matter of pasting them or typing them in here. Uh, next to database name. Make sure you don't change anything here other than what's in between these brackets. So just enter the database name, database username and database pa uh, password and that's all you need to do and then just save the file. Uh, just go up here and click to save and, uh, and just save the file. So it's pretty straightforward really. If, you ha if you're having problems with that and you get stuck, you get, there's more information on my blog post which describes how to do it in text. Uh, and there are other method methods as I suggested before. There's, uh, there's a WordPress plugin which I've, uh, I've placed a link uh, to under this tab in WordPress on my site. Um, and, and the other option there, if you really want to simplify it, is that HostGator will, will do this for you if you have a plan with them or you transfer your hosting with them. So if you haven't chosen a web host yet, I suggest you have a look at HostGator. And I'll, I've included a coupon on my site where you get 25% off a hosting package. So if you click through to HostGator and you use the coupon code WordPress Hosting Sale, you'll get a 25% discount and they'll also transfer your site or um, install your new WordPress site if you've bought a site or uh, if you've got a turnkey niche site for instance or you want to change host or domain. They'll do all that for you free of charge. So uh, consider that and it's a good deal 25% off. So cheers.